Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jake, and as you know, I like to invest money. Who would have thought, right? But I was thinking lately, um, I heard a, a podcast a little while ago by Bigger Pockets, and they always talk about money. If you don't know who they are, I would suggest checking them out because they're quite awesome. Um, they have two podcasts they have one about uh, real estate, and one about um, just a money show. So, I was listening to one the other day, and I realized that they were talking about uh, just growing money, growing in uh, real estate and whatnot. I was like, they also started talking about donating money, and how you shouldn't wait until you're rich to donate money, because it'll never happen, right? You just gotta donate money as you go along. And me, I've always wanted to help people out as much as I could. I house hack, try to give people a different, uh, cheaper rate on housing versus having to go out and pay for a, an apartment uh, through the five years that I've owned my home. And that got me thinking a little bit how I could be beneficial to both myself and, and also donate my, because I don't have a lot of time to donate my money, which there's not very much of that as well, but uh, I want to give as much as I could. So what I thought would be a good idea was to invest over the course of 52 weeks and then donate half the money to charity, to a charity. I haven't figured that far out, but I just started this this week and I figured I also wanted to also test out this app called Acorns. I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard about Acorns. They do the roundups. They will take your spare change and they'll invest it for you. Or you can uh, set reoccurring, reoccurring payments and they will invest those for you. And you can set your, I guess your pain tolerance level, either moderate risk or extremely risky. And from what I've seen, the extremely risky or whatever is not as risky as a lot of people even say. There's a few risky things in there, but there's not a lot. On top of that, I wanted to try to grow this for 52 weeks, and then, I, so I'm not worried necessarily about dates, I just want the weeks. And I started that literally this week. I want to do $5, like I said, for 52 weeks. So, with that being said, I want to show you a couple of Excel spreadsheets that I made just to kind of visualize uh, and this way I could test out Acorns to see if it is as profitable or less profitable than averages, right? So a 2% savings account versus a 7% uh, return in the normal stock market in the S&P 500, right? So versus also to just if I just pocketed that money and then donated. So uh, $5 a day for 52 weeks. All right, so let's look at this here. Quick. All right, guys, so this is the Acorns app. I just went straight to their uh, potential here. Um, I am in an aggressive, quote unquote, aggressive growth portfolio, I guess you could say. And as you see here, I do have my $5 every day. And I literally started this two days. So there is nothing in there right now. I think it takes one to three days to get started, um, but like I said, uh, I'm looking to grow this $5 a day up to a year and then donate after that every year. So that way I can try different amounts. Like like I said, this year, and the reason I'm, I want to keep half, I guess I should bring up, the reason I want to bring keep half is this year I want to do $5. The next 52 weeks I want to do $10 and, and just keep adding $5 onto that. So if I'm able to keep half that profit, I can start saving to meet the next goal with that larger chunk of cash, if that makes sense to you guys. So like I said, the 52 weeks after this first year, I want to do $10 and then the next 52 weeks, I want to do 15 and just grow. And I figured eventually that way, it might be a small pot now, but maybe in the next five years, it can become a much larger pot for myself and for charity as well. Um, again, I want to do something that helps the most amount of people. I don't want to donate 
uh, say just to one individual or to one cause I would like to eventually be able to broaden and donate to multiple charities maybe one that helps out animals and people but uh, right now I'm thinking more about like food and food shelves especially with like shortages and stuff like that so I think that's the way I'm leaning but I just wanted to go over this a little bit with you as well um, I can show you my projections here what I've done math on my own so I have the week here, the sock drawer I'm calling it. So if I was just to stick this money in a sock drawer and hold on to it, how much it would be. And this is a 2% savings rate. So if I just put the $35 for week one in, what it'd be at the end of the year. And then same goes with the 7% and that would be the average of the stock market. Then here I'm gonna record uh, what Acorn actually gives me. So that way I can see if it's higher or lower than any of these. If it's higher than this, it'll probably be green. If it's higher than this, it'll be yellow. And if it's higher than this, it'll probably be, or lower than this, it'll be red. So that way we'll be able to see throughout the year or throughout the upcoming weeks, how it affects. If it beats Robin Hood, if it beats my sock drawer, if it beats what it beats, you know? If we go all the way to the bottom here, you can see that just saving $5 a day will yield you $18.20. And then that in the stock, or I'm sorry, in a savings account, it'd be $18.56.40. And then in a 7% return, it would be $19.47.40. So I just kind of, I just kind of made this so I could see if Acorn is truly the way I want to go for this first year or if there is a better way or if there's something I personally should be doing to maybe grow this money faster so I can have more to give away. Just uh, an idea I had guys. I don't know if it's any good or not. I'm just gonna wing it and see how things turn out. Um, I've always wanted to help people. I've been trying to help people throughout my short life as I've had so far. Um, with little resources that I've had as well but I really think this is at least a semi decent idea so that way I'm not straining myself here trying to donate a thousand dollars here a thousand dollars there it's just like something I can slowly build and then give away and I know donating half of it it's not gonna be a significant amount especially not at first but I'm hoping over the years I'm able to try to build something out of it, build a little bit of a pot so I can go and give that away. And I'm just a regular guy. I'm not even that good with money. I would say I just like to watch numbers grow. And this is a good way to test out for me too, to see even if, even if uh, Acorn is a decent app. Uh, Cause I used to use Acorn in the past, but I haven't for some number of years so I don't even know how it is now and for anybody who knows me too I guess I have always wanted to help I I've gone through CNA and EMT courses and I actually wanted to be a nurse but life happened and I was unable to kind of go about that route so as of right now this is the my next best way I can help out the most amount of people and with that being said guys I'm I know it's a little bit uh, slower content but this is something that's just been rattling in my brain I'm like you know what I'm just gonna pull the trigger I'm just gonna do it and it is it is I'll put it out there into the void and I'll try to bring you guys updates every four weeks that's why I have that four week uh, highlighted yellow I want to make sure I try to try to put out some content for you guys and try to show you how uh, everything's growing and try to do something uh, to help out people and I'm sorry I keep rambling about that but all right I'll cut it there guys uh, thank you for watching make sure you like subscribe if you want to see more of this I'll try to update you guys frequently but with that being said peace